<laughs> Hi Jammers, so good to see you today. Welcome to Jam Online. Ooh, I hope you've had a good week and I'm so glad you're here with me today. Oh, today we're talking about Jesus, the Prince of Peace. Have you ever been worried? Have you ever been a little bit scared? Well, we can look to Jesus because he is the Prince of Peace. Oh, that's what we're talking about today. But first... It's time to do some worship, so let's jump up on your feet, because it's time to sing and dance and worship God and tell Jesus how much we love him. Let's do that right now. Did you follow along? Did you dance? Did you tell God how wonderful he is? Oh, well done. Right now, it's time to grab your Bibles because it's time for the 60 second scripture find. Quick, grab the big rescue Bible because it's now time to play the 60 second scripture find. Okay, grab your Bibles because today we're going to look up a scripture. Are you ready? You have 60 seconds to look it up and see if you can beat the clock. Today's scripture is Mark chapter 4, verse 39. And your time starts now.
Mark chapter 4 verse 39. Jesus got up and ordered the wind and waves to be quiet. The wind stopped and everything was calm. (laughs) Mark chapter 4 verse 39. Did you find it? It's so great when we can look up God's word, when we can look and read scripture together. And we get to have it in a fun way. So we have to race and try to get there before the 60 seconds is done. And the best bit is, if you haven't quite found it, you can push pause and you can stop and find it and then push play so you can, we can all read the passage together. Well done, everyone. But right now, it's time for today's lesson. So get comfy and check this out. Jam Lesson, The Peace of God Do you sometimes get worried? Do you sometimes get scared? Do you sometimes get anxious? Do you sometimes feel like your heart is in a storm? Did you know Jesus is the Prince of Peace? Isaiah chapter 9 verses 6 and 7 says, A child has been born for us. We have been given a son who will be our ruler. His name will be Wonderful Advisor and Mighty God, Eternal Father and Prince of Peace. His power will never end. Peace will last forever. And that passage was talking about Jesus. Jesus came to give us life. Jesus said in John chapter 10, verse 10 and 11, A thief comes only to rob, kill and destroy. I came so everyone would have life and have it to the full. I am the good shepherd and the good shepherd gives up his life for the sheep. Sometimes our thoughts can run away and get us worried about things that we don't need to worry about. The Bible tells us that we need to take our thoughts captive and then our thoughts can bring us worry or peace. Thinking like the world brings bad things, but thinking according to the Holy Spirit and thinking about Jesus and what he has done will give us life and peace. Romans chapter 8 verse 6 If our minds are ruled by our desires, we will die. But if our minds are ruled by the Spirit, We will have life and peace. The best way to capture our wrong thoughts is to stop focusing on the negative and focus on Jesus and positive things. Philippians chapter 4 verse 8 says, Finally, my friends, keep your minds on whatever is true, pure, right, holy, friendly and proper. Don't ever stop thinking about what is truly worthwhile and worthy of praise. And the thing that's most worthy of praise is Jesus. He is the one who's worthy of all of our praise. When we find ourselves in storms, don't get rocked. Just look to Jesus and ask for his peace to fill your heart and mind. Philippians chapter 4 verses 6 and 7 says, Don't worry about anything. Pray about everything. With thankful hearts, offer up your prayers and requests to God. Then, because you belong to Christ Jesus, God will bless you with peace that no one can completely understand, and his peace will control the way you think and feel. Jesus told his disciples this in John chapter 14, verse 27. I give you peace, the kind of peace only I can give. It isn't like the peace the world can give, so don't be worried or afraid. So we don't need to worry either. The peace that Jesus gives comes from the Holy Spirit, who is with us always and forever if we are friends with Jesus. So we can trust Jesus and receive his peace in our hearts and minds from the Holy Spirit. So when you feel worried, scared, anxious, Stop and pray and ask God for help. Look to Jesus and receive God's peace from the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Wow! Jesus is the Prince of Peace. And 
if we get scared or we get worried or we don't know what to do, we can run to Jesus. Oh, and God gives us the Holy Spirit and the Holy Spirit is with us. And he's like a big warm hug to remind us of everything that Jesus has done, to remind us of God's love and to remind us that Jesus is our Prince of Peace and he's the Good Shepherd and we his sheep and he will lead us through and look after us. Oh, if we do things God's way, it positions us in the best place for us to hear God's word, hear God's voice, and to know what God wants us to do. And when we know what God wants us to do, we can trust him and know that he is with us. Hoo -hoo. Right now, we've got a great cartoon. And it's about, don't worry, just trust God. Check this out. This is thankful. Don't worry. This is Jesus, hey who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. Jesus did many amazing things. He taught everyone about God's love, healed people from their sickness, and even calmed storms. Shush, shush. One day, Jesus was speaking to thousands of people. Hey, Jesus! When someone asked him about money, he told them a story and tried to explain to the people that our treasure is not on earth, but in heaven. Then he turned to one of his disciples and said, That is why I tell you not to worry about everyday life, whether you have enough food to eat or enough clothes to wear, for life is more than food, and your body more than clothing. Uh, I guess. Look at the ravens. They don't plant or harvest or store food in barns because God feeds them. And you are far more valuable to God than any birds. Uh, yeah, I think so. Do you think that by worrying about anything, you can add a single moment to your life? And if worry can't do a little thing like that, what's the use of worrying over bigger things? That's a good point. Look at all the lilies and how they grow. They don't work or make their clothing. Yet Solomon, the great king of Israel, in all his glory was not dressed as beautifully as they are. And if God cares so wonderfully for flowers that are here today and thrown away tomorrow, he will certainly care for you. And don't worry about what to eat or what to drink. Hey, okay. Many people worry about these things, but God already knows what you need. Seek the kingdom of God above all else, and he will give you everything you need. So don't be afraid, for it makes God happy to take care of you and give you his kingdom. So share what you have with others and give to those who need. There you go. Thank you. Sorry. Hi. Then you'll be storing up treasure in heaven. And when your treasure is in heaven, it's going to be safe. No thief can steal it. And no bug can destroy it. Wherever your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Wow! Today's lesson is not just a lesson for when we're kids, it's a lesson for us throughout our whole lives. For teenagers, for mums and dads, for grown-ups, for grandparents that Jesus is the Prince of Peace. And if we feel worried or scared or don't know what to do, we can look to Jesus. We can uh, ask him and follow his leading and hear what the Holy Spirit's saying and know that God loves us. Oh, because Jesus is our Prince of Peace. Oh, it's so important to remember that if we get worried or scared, we can look to God. We can open God's word, the Bible, and we can remember what Jesus has done and how much he loves us. Oh, and we can know that God is with us because Jesus says he'll never leave us nor forsake us. And he gives us the Holy Spirit to be with us, to walk through this life, to live for him. Oh, God is so good. And Jesus is our Prince of Peace. I hope you've enjoyed today's lesson. We're going to see you again really, 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 really soon. Next time at Jam Online. Bye! Yeah.
fades away as we gaze upon your face All anxiety is gone, your life, your love, your embrace There is nothing or no one who can separate me from you Overwhelmed by who you are and all you do All creation stands in awe As the universe declares your praise Jesus We stand and lift our hands As we magnify your name Stands in awe as the universe declares your. 